Good dear students, I am Ajay Karmarkar. Before starting this video, I would like to say something. Please sit with copy pen. If you find somewhere important, then note it and proceed further. And although you have facing any problem or difficulties, please write in comment box. I will definitely solve your problem. And along with, please like, share and subscribe my channel that can reach more and more students. Thank you. Now here is the question. A coil of inductance 8.4 millihenry and resistance 6 ohm is connected to a 12 volt battery. The current in the coil is 1 ampere. At approximately the time, option A 500 second, option B 25 second, option C 35 millisecond, option D 1 millisecond. And this question is asked IIT 1997. Now, in this question, we have to given inductance 8.4 millihenry, resistance is given 6 ohm, potential is given that 12 ohm, and uh, current is given that RMS current is given that 1 ampere. And in LR circuit, the equation shows that current and time that is I equal to I naught 1 minus E raised to power minus T by tau. Here tau is time constant and I naught that is peak value. And you are very well known about that. When we plot graph between current and time, then maximum crust that shows that is peak value. Okay. So here the peak value, if there is no any losses, that time we have using I naught equal to V by R. Here what is potential? Potential given is 12 volt and resistance is given that 6 ohm, 6 on the 6, 6 to the 12, then I naught equal to 2 ampere. Okay. And uh, tau, time constant, its formula is L by R. So what is L? We are given that 8.4, that is millihenry. It means 10 raised to power minus 3. Whenever we have using milli, means 10 raised to power minus 3. And resistance is given that 6 ohm. Okay. And it is time constant, so it's a unit is second. 6 on the 6 and uh, 6 for the 24. 1.4 into 10 raised to power minus 3 second. Okay. So here we get I naught and tau. Now substitute this equation, equation number first. Okay. Now we have substituted all this value, 1 RMS value, 1 ampere, that is 2 is the maximum or peak value, 1 minus E minus T and here tau value 1.4 into 10 raised to power minus 3. We are 1 by 2 equal to 1 minus e raised to power minus t 1.4 into 10 raised to power minus t. Now transposing this term e raised to power minus t 1.4 into 10 raised to power minus 3 equal to 1 minus 1 by 2. Then it become 1 by 2. Now e raised to power minus t so it can be written as 1 upon e raised to power t 1.4 into 10 raised to power minus 3. Now transposing all these terms now it become 2 equal to t raised to power t upon 1.4 into 10 raised to power minus 3. Now, it can be written as log e2 equal to t upon 1.4 into 10 raised to power minus 3. Remember, here natural log. So, let us first we have to convert into base tail log to multiply 2.303 and then log 10 2. Here log 2 to the base 10, its value is 0 0.3010. So here 30.301 equal to t into 1.4 into 10 to the power minus 3. So now multiply t equal to 2.303 into 0 0.301 into 1.4 into 10 to the power minus 3. Then its value is approximately 0 0.97 into 10 to the power minus 3 second. So approximately its value is 1 millisecond. Okay. So let's see here option D is correct. I hope so. You understood this question. Thank you for staying till the end of this video. Definitely for your success all the credit goes to your hard work. But if my video will help for your success then I will consider myself lucky. 
थैंक यू वंस अगेन टेक केयर बाय बाय